Hello everyone. Recently, Shock from Netherlands asked me how to use an IFC format to create an object in DDS CAD. Well, if you have the same doubt, take a look at this video. Enjoy! In order to use an external reference to create your 2D symbol or 3D object inside DDS CAD, this file format must be inserted in a user directory and we can f find this folder very easily when we have the DSCAD opened. We go to menu tools, external folder and then we click on user. You can see here that I have previously inserted this IFC of an end handling unit from Daken. This is the one that I will import right now. Okay. After you have inserted your file, you can close this explorer. The next step is to open the object editor. If you don't remember how to do so, see the suggested video above. I will open here from the explorer and I will import the IFC, external reference. To do so, I come to menu insert, external resource, and then I select this IFC file management. You click on new and if by chance the, the file format is not correct, you click on the list here and you come to IFC file. Now select the file you want to import and click OK. OK, it has been imported to the editor. We see here the 2D, OK? If you'd like to insert any other geometry, you, can, you could do so. And you could also insert in electrical connection or mechanical connection, HVAC connection, as we can see here. If you don't remember how to do so, take a look at the suggested video above, okay? When you have finished to edit your, your object, save. And we can come back to, to the model. Afterwards, we have to open the product database in order to insert the object. So select one discipline and like I have made this copy, I will click on change and I can insert this external symbol, the same name for as the editor, as you can see here, A -A 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 okay? Click OK, click OK, and the object will be inserted in the model. We could also see the 3D. Would you like to see more videos like this? So subscribe to our channel and hit the bell to be notified of the new videos. And what else would you like to know about the DSCAD? Put it on your comment below and I can make a video for you. Cheers!